We go again. Luna Rosa Prada Pirelli, New York Yacht Club's American Magic. Up, okay. Jim, Jim, please. Please this side up here. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, out. even these lines fine, I think. No hey, problems here. Boards, fine. Yeah, this is good. Okay. Nice calm heads on board American Magic here. Okay, showing low here. Okay. Running low inside. Okay, we're going to attack up. Hey, milking. Hey, milking as much as you can. Okay, so Luna Ross will coast as far as they can down the boundary there. Okay. American Magic roll good, okay? will roll into attack. Hey, coming up hard, boys. Got on line here. And then look to roll or put yeah. pressure on Luna Rossa, and Luna Rossa potentially trying to hold them out yeah. above that committee boat lay line. Yeah. Tom Slingsby hoping just to yeah. get yeah. in yeah. there Order to the right. Order. Okay, we can start the slow okay, edge boys. from here. Okay, coming down now. Okay, here we go. Starting to roll down. Both books early. Keep going, okay, guys. We'll speed at this one. We'll get a You'll see the boat speeds here just start rocketing as they accelerate one down to edging. 90 degree oh, reaching. Big push here. Not quite loose there on Luna Rossa. We are a go in the fourth right, race right. between Luna Rossa Prada Perley and nice American one. Magic. Nicely oh, yeah. controlled by American Magic. Beautiful start. Yeah, we're going a little higher more than you are. Very good yeah, ball, guys. Yeah. Okay, we're matching board. Okay, we're matching board. Three. 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 Hey, lock her in there. Yeah. Yeah. BMG here. Okay, coming up to target speed now. No threat to lure, just a normal boat. Really yeah. even performance here by both boats, Shirley. It's uh, just a good slight game yeah. there. Yeah. Starting yeah. tight to lure for the Italian yeah. team. Yeah. Two, one, four down. Pretty good much uh, as you'd expect, Luna Rossa. Putting the foot on the throat of American Magic. Luna Rossa Prada Pirelli with an almost identical track to the first race. They said one and in, and it was one and in last time. It's one and in this time. But American Magic appear to have just gained a little bit, a little bit on that upward leg. But it will be Luna Rossa Prada Pirelli at the top gate for the first time. They'll take that left mark as you see it right for them. And American Magic will take the opposing mark and follow them around. Only six seconds, nothing. American Magic have done well here to keep this tight. Oh, Question sitting in my it's head is, down. how do they get back into this, Glenn? Well, they're certainly not giving up the chase. That is 100% sure. And just need to keep it tight, keep the pressure on the Italian team. Just wanting to think that we can maybe lay this, but... We'll be up more up after one board, the board, one board down for the... Oh, we got one board down there. Okay, uh, not long here. One board, okay. Okay, stand by. Thank you, it's further. Put down here in three. Going Lingy Red Bull Racing coming into that cable right that just over 43 knots at the bottom. They take the left hand mark as you see it. Whoa, it's rough out there. That's a big, big skid there using the bustle to grip the boat. You see the wash of the Italians there. It's not their best rounding. They'll be wishing they had to go on the two board option there, but they didn't, took it on. Much tighter rounding by the Americans. They're back in the game. Uh, yeah, teams are evenly matched. Look, this is coming down to those small meters. After that top mark rounding first time, American Magic had a, a touch and go touchdown, which was a little bit costly for them, uh, which took out the, the, the delta to 11 seconds at the bottom mark. But then uh, Luna Russell Prada rally did that skid. So that was really two little errors by both teams that pulled it all back together. But I've still got a speed advantage to Luna Russell Prada Prada on the second one to beat. If they can now, it would be no way 
Italians just working hard to try and lock this race down and not let the Americans wriggle free. We've reached the halfway point in this fourth race between Luna Rosa and American Magic. And it will be the Italians that get around that mark and head down for leg number four. In come the Americans. Hanging in there. Hanging in there. Go hard. Go hard, guys. Go hard. Good angle, Tom. Still not much between these two boats. The Luna Rossa team will be looking out the window going, these guys just aren't going away. They're on the long board here, guys. A minute 20 this way. American Magic on the right jibe. They look great, BMG here. Eight legs behind, gents. Keep working. Got a pressure now. Now we're in big breeze. We'll just see what this angle is. Leggy Red Bull Racing. Look at that. Almost 48 coming into the bottom mark to complete leg number four. They've got to manhandle the seven tonner around the, the mark and they do it just like that. In comes American Magic. Both boards down, playing it safe in these conditions. Actually only seconds now in this race, so the Americans 100% breathing down the neck of the Italian team. Luna Rossa aggressively protecting the right-hand side of the track. It's closing up. If you remember the first race of the semi-final between these two, it wasn't until leg five that Luna Rossa got the lead uh, because American Mention had come out of the gate flying. Could we see the same thing? Yeah, we're going to go on a ley line, a comfortable ley line here. A bit, rolling up a touch rocket. Tack to the top gate for the last time. But look who is coming out pace. <laughs> Right them and comes American Magic. Wow, they've picked up some some gas coming in, and this will be the last leg heading home. Race four between these two in the Louis Vuitton Cup semi-finals. Have American Magic got something in the tank? American Magic have had a really strong second half to this race. Initially, I thought, uh, well, they've had another one of those little touchdown jibes on America's Magic. How costly is that going to be? I was giving them a bouquet, but that last jibe was a bit of a slider. American Magic are certainly in the hunt with this one. Really close here. American Magic on a huge tow away puff here, so they are the giveaway boat. It's rolling up to him, maybe. Yep. Luck. Yeah, a bit tight for the Catanaccio at the moment. Oh, yeah. Can they try a lockdown? If he does, probably roll oh, out. Would. Okay, okay, it'll be your board then. Yeah, no, it'll just be a normal. Yeah, copy. Sure-wise. Super cool okay, heads on board. Here, American Magic, great. No, we're Words of wisdom there by Tom Slingsby. Keeping it chill. Well, they can't not all the way down here on Luna Rossa Prada Pirelli. That's not their best jibe. The Italians didn't get the board all the way down, so games back to the Americans here. This is going to be bow and bow. American Magic right of way out. Big push, boys. Big fun, boys. Final quarter of the last leg in a race four. American Magic with the green have right of way. Have they got enough speed? I think we are crossing. Coming down here. crossing. Are they going to snatch one? Trim us down. Yeah, all good. Everything trim us down. Oh, super close here. Possible protest. So, Luna Rossa, Prada Pirelli, get the win and a close win at that. Wow, two seconds. That's a hard round. Confirmation of probably the tightest race we've had this whole regatta. Two seconds. A two second win to Luna Rossa, Prada Pirelli.